So we are in the newly renovated lower gallery, our rotating exhibit space in the uh, lower level of the Truman Library. This is recently renovated space as part of our big major renovation that we've just completed. And we're very pleased and proud to have the George W. Bush paintings here. But to have something creative like this be a part of our offering and something we can share with the public, it's really quite unique. Mr. Truman, I think, would have been very pleased to know that a tribute to veterans was taking place at his library in this way. One of the really truly inspiring things about it is that George Bush didn't take up painting until after he left office. So he's approaching what for most Americans would be sort of normal retirement age and he's taking up a whole new not just hobby but passion. You know art can speak to us in, in ways that other things can't in the same way that you know music can speak in the way that other things can't. So any, any form of art is is worth experiencing and I think that it will be interesting for people to come here and understand that you know the, the, he's really captured here I think the the lives of, of these uh, of these warriors we're very pleased to have the Bush exhibit here because it represents not only a tribute to these wounded warriors that he's captured but it's also a tribute to Mr. Truman it's so interesting and unique to have something from a former president hanging in the library of another former president. And I think being able to show art of this caliber and of this nature and in this way is a great thing for the Truman Library and it's particularly good for the people of Independence. It doesn't cost any extra to come and see this exhibit. If you get into the library to see the, the main Truman exhibits, you'll be granted access to these uh, portraits as well. If you like this exhibit and if you love what you see upstairs, uh, which you will, I promise, uh, buy a membership so that you can come more regularly and not have to uh, worry about spending the number of hours it takes to get through everything. Just come and do it a little bit at a time.